My name is Gadi Shamia, I'm founder and CEO of Magneto. Uh, I'm here actually with another Magneto colleague, uh, David Shire, with my founder and CTO. Sit over there, so if you want to ask questions, you can at the end. Um, and Magneto is a calendar. Um, I'm, by the way, I'm going to attempt to demo today both the web version of Magneto and the iOS, so bear with me as I switch. Uh, Magneto is a calendar that does many things that other calendars don't do. And because I only have five minutes that will start very soon, uh, I'm not going to try to show you everything Magneto does, but I'm going to focus on three things. Uh, on adding automatic travel time to your calendar so you're never late to meetings. On the fastest way possible to add meetings to your calendar from any web page. And integrate smart to do to your calendar. Behind all this, Magneto is a full calendar system uh, available both on iOS as a browser extension, as a full web application, and connects to Google and Chrome. I'll do it again. Maybe it will work now. It worked before, which doesn't mean that it will work again. Yeah? Yes. All right. All right. We're in. So I will start with Magneto uh, on the iPhone app. And as you can see, this is, this is my, uh, or my user demo day. And as you can see here, for every meeting, instead of having this typical meeting, two hours, meeting, two hours, I actually have a block for travel time. And this travel time is predictive. It's based on the time of the day. It's based on where I'm leaving from. And it takes into account statistical traffic for this day. And once this travel time is added to your calendar, we actually start monitoring it. So if traffic changes, if one-on-one you know, gets messed up, which it often does, we'll alert you to leave earlier or later based on traffic. Now, it's super easy to get meetings with travel time. Uh, we made data entry really easy. So if I have a meeting with Bob, um, it's always Bob or BK. Um, at 5 p.m. or you know 9 p.m. Uh, tomorrow, all I have to do is pick a place, my side class, I have all the complete for location, and by selecting the place, Magneto will automatically know where I'm coming from and add travel time uh, to, my, to my calendar. And it will take me 20 minutes to leave to get the side class from where I'm going to be before that, uh, which is home. So this is um, the first feature I want to show you. And I want to switch quickly to um, to the web. I'll do it already. It's fine. Uh, I want to switch quickly to the web because there's one more awesome thing we've done with the travel time feature that was asked by. Yeah, this is not going to work, huh? Uh, that was asked by many of our of our users. So we give you travel time. We help you being on time to all your meetings during throughout the month. But then at the end of the month, nobody bothered to extend their miles. And if you know, uh, every mile you travel for work you can get back 56 cents per mile. So if you travel 200 miles a month, it can be $100 that you get back to um, as a reimbursement. So Magneto has uh, export to Expensify. You see all your business trips. You can update them and you know add return trip, for example. And when you're ready, you just click Send to Expensify, and all your trips go to your expense report, and you can get reimbursed for them. So literally, Magneto puts money back in your pocket. Number two, the easiest way to add meetings to your calendar. How many of you went to this page and used this page, and sorry, it's kind of hard to see, use this page to create a meeting? Uh, typically, it's kind of complicated. You have to alt tab, copy, paste. If you have Magneto, we have this browser extension. All you need to do is click on it, and we automatically get the information from the page, event, time, date, address, uh, give you travel time, and with one click, edit to your calendar. And you can also see your availability per this day, so you know if you're busy or not. And you can do the same thing with a Facebook event. Um, so it's not limited to one type of event. You can do it with a Facebook event. You can do it with a Yelp restaurant. If you want to go to an after party in Palo Alto, click on Yelp. You go and grab the restaurant uh, name, the address, and you can just click here to put it in your calendar. We're going to give you travel time, and you're done. Um, and my favorite feature, by the way, you can do the same thing from an email. Uh, you go to the email. Let's schedule a meeting. Click here, or it's actually about something you need to get done. Click here. We're going to grab everybody in this email. We're going to grab the email's context. Hit save, it's in Magneto. So easiest way in the world to add meetings to your calendar. The third thing, which I use the web UI, which is kind of washed here, sorry for that, to show is to-dos. So as I said, Magneto integrates smart to-dos into your calendar. So the first thing you can do, and it's really hard to, to see, is like this write a blog post. We actually have checkbox for meetings. You can define a meeting as a to-do, and if you don't get it done, and you can actually check it when it's done, and if you don't get it done, we're going, to not, we're going to tap on your shoulder and say, hey, finish this to-do. The second thing we do is we recommend to-dos based on places you're going to be that week, 
people you're going to meet and due dates. So at the top of the page, you're always going to see the most recommended to-dos for you. Um, and by the way, if you really like to see things on the map, you can see your to-dos on the map as well. So this map will show you all your meetings, my first meeting and my second meeting, and also a to-do that you can actually get done near one of your meetings. Uh, and if you want to get a to-do done, the best thing to do is schedule it in your calendar, because if it's on your calendar, it's not going to get done. So the simplest thing, you can just take a to-do, drag it to your day, and put it here, and now you have a scheduled meeting uh, in, in, with a to-do. Everything you do in Magneto will synchronize back to your Google Calendar for personal meeting, for exchange, for work meetings. So everything is up to date. And other people that collaborate with you, for example, we see block time for to do, block time for uh, for travel for meetings, and so on. So it's, we're not an isolated system. We work in tandem with your Exchange Calendar and Google Calendar. And we kind of bring both of them together. How much time do I have? You got 30 seconds. 30 seconds. <laughs> what would I do in 30 seconds? <laughs> so. As I said, uh, full calendar system that uh, is available on iOS, on the web, and as an extension. It's cloud-based, so everything is real-time. Every meeting you create here in Magneto on the phone will be uh, available real-time in, uh, in your calendar. And there's other kind of features, like search. Uh, if you want to search across your calendar, personal, and, uh, and, and work, quick search, you can get all your work meetings, all your personal meetings that have MI in them, including to-dos. Um, the same feature you saw before, like travel time, available here as well. So every meeting you create will have full autocomplete uh, for locations. Uh, we support attachments, including on the phone. So if you have attachments and you attach a, uh, something to the meeting, you can get it on the phone as well. Uh, so it's a long 30 seconds, Gadi. It's a long 30 seconds, <laughs> so I'm done. Thank you, Gadi. Let's open it up for Q&A. So one announcement. If you want to sign up to Magneto, we're still in beta, but this link will get you directly into Magneto and you can sign up right now or at home. I'll tweet this link after uh, and maybe you will tweet. Yes, Lev. So, are you on Android and extension to Magneto? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 Please answer, repeat the question. Yes. Are we on Android? The answer is not yet, uh, but we definitely plan to be on Android. The second question is, can I share with my calendar with other folks? Because of the five minutes limit, I did not did not show the share uh, your calendar feature, but there is a way to share a snapshot of your calendar for the next two weeks with people, so you can schedule meetings. Uh, haven't seen it; it's a feature for you to discover. Next question. Have you been able to kind of work with the enterprise so that our work email can be connected to our calendar and Yes, the question is, can you connect your, I'm, I'm rephrasing it, can you connect your work calendar to, uh, to Magneto? So uh, when it comes to Google work calendars, we have 100% success rate because Google is not limited by any security, specific security. When it comes to Exchange, uh, we're successful in many cases. Uh, we have users from Microsoft, we have users from eBay, from, from many of the large enterprises. Um, and we also have users that have securities in a way that we cannot, uh, behind VPN, or have security that does not, does not allow us to, uh, to connect. And in the future, we plan to work with directly with IT, but we just launched a couple of months ago to beta. It's, it's not the time yet. Okay. Thank you. Yes. So Google Now has one feature. Uh, out of everything I described, Google Now does one thing, which is it lets you know 30, before you need to leave to a meeting that this is the time to leave. It doesn't block time on your calendar, which means other people might block time on it. And more philosophically, with the reason we block time on the calendar for, for travel, we block this predictive time, is that you, for you to plan to be on time. We realize it's not helpful to get your phone buzz and say, leave now. What are you going to do? Just wrap up everything, run off the car, you know, get to your car. It might take you 10 minutes to get there. It doesn't take into account parking. So we realize that the best way to be on time is to plan to be on time. This is why we block this time on your calendar. And we also do what Google Now does, which is let you know when to leave right now. Uh, yes, and then yes. Yes, you first. You mentioned that uh, uh, I guess it's browser extension. Um, it's for which browsers? browsers. Uh, we support two browsers right now with a browser extension, Chrome and Firefox. Uh, planned for IE uh, in the future. Maybe I should talk with the IE team to make it easier for us. Uh, <laughs> yes, here, IE. <laughs> Uh, I, as I still left, somebody will ask about the revenue model. Uh, so right now, revenue model is get as many users as possible. Uh, Condor is a bit. Our plan eventually is to get into into the 
professionals in the enterprise and charge for group features. Our initial focus was on individual features, individual activity, so everybody that uses Magneto right now, even if they're low in the world, can benefit from it. But we plan to go to group features, group scheduling, and others, and, and monetize uh, around these. Yes, sir. <coughs> Uh, we, we don't do learning yet, so what we do, the question was, how do you predict when to arrive to a meeting? Uh, what we do is we look at when you need to arrive to a meeting, we buffer a little bit of time for, for parking, and then we look at the statistical time it takes to arrive from where you're going to be to your meeting at this time of the day. Uh, and we take into account some other, other factors and give you a block. Uh, if you, for example, uh, are always late and leave always 10 minutes after we tell you, we don't compensate for this yet. We give you tools to do that, but we don't compensate for this yet. David, my CTO, wait for the moment you can apply machine learning and do that, and we'll do it as long as, as soon as we have enough data. Last question. Yes, sir. So where are you getting your statistical data for deriving your uh, 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 We get it from various data sources. One of them is Indrix, which powers most of the cars that, that we, uh, we drive. Uh, the other is Google, and we combine. We have an algorithm that deals with, um, that merge them all together and, and try to get a better result uh, out of it. Okay. Thank you, Gotti. Thank you very much. And if you guys want to find out more about Magneto Calendar, don't forget to download it at the link, or Gotti will be around for the networking portion to, ask, uh, to answer follow-up questions.